Welcome to another Onkai Star Rail Gacha video. Today we are grabbing for the stars for a chance to get just intonation. Robin, a harmony physical type character. Let's see. Oh, this is gonna go. Alongside Robin on the banner are also three four-star characters that I have not maxed out yet. With March needing one more and Suayi and Hanya both having one so far. So really, I'm glad about every duplicate I can get. Not sure if you are maxed out though. I guess all the duplicates that are on the banner I'm fine with. Mostly I would like some Shua Yi's because I actually want to use her and so far I've not really gotten the chance to. Although, more than any duplicate, I would prefer to just get Robin as quickly as possible. Hi, Shuayi. Also, yes, Asta was maxed out. And I'm kinda hoping I get Robin relatively quickly because I would also like to keep some of my gacha tickets for the next version of the game. But who knows if my luck will be that good. So far so good on the duplicates though. And much is maxed out completely. So now I would prefer not getting any more duplicates of her. I think I went into this with no pity whatsoever. So we are gonna get what we are gonna get. Hopefully we won't need 90 pulls. If, and that's a big if, I get a 5 star on every 70. And I would have about enough for getting 3 5 star characters saved up. Although maybe we don't need to. Maybe this is just gonna be Robin. And that would be the best case scenario. As it is. So it goes. Guess my luck is not letting me down just yet. Now I still have quite a lot saved up for the next version. Not gonna go for her light counter. 
Maybe I'll pick it up in the future sometime. When there is less pressing matters in the near future. Let's see. First of all, how many duplicates did I get for everybody? I just got one march as I needed. So that's good. Just like this. Always. Allies under the protection of the shield granted by the skill restore HP equal to 4% of their max HP bonus. Plus 106. So now March is a shielder and a healer. <laughs> My past is gradually coming to light. So that's very good. Especially because I like using her a lot to begin with. Shuayi, how many of you did I get? Pleasure, breached. Talent's follow-up attack reduces enemy toughness regardless of weakness types. At the same time, restores Shuayi's HP by an amount equal to 5% of her max HP. So she's a bit of a self-healer. Serving under the Ten Lords as a judge of souls, I come to the world of the living to enforce their will. But more importantly... A breaker that doesn't really care about elements. Upgrades for skill and basic attack. As a judge of souls, I come to the world of the living to enforce their will. Karma severed. When using ultimate, increases break effect by forty percent for two turns. Serving under the ten lords as a judge of souls, I come to the world of the living to enforce their will. Not bad. Not quite maxed out, but already a lot more usable. Two views. After using that skill, this character's speed increases by 20% for one turn. In the obscure prophecy of dream, a star from the heavens has enlightened my path. And an upgrade for skill and basic attack. In the obscure prophecy of dream, a star from the heavens has enlightened my path. Not sure if I'm gonna use Hannah, but she is quite useful. So it would be good to get her up to speed. Now, let's actually take a look at Robin. Because she is very unique in how she works. Someone that I would argue fits on most teams without problems. Robin's ultimate activates Concerto, making all allies immediately take action. Concerto increases attack for the whole team. After teammates attack, triggers additional damage. After an ally attacks, Robin regenerates energy. So, her allies get to move immediately after her when she is ultimate. During her ultimate state, they deal additional physical damage and Robin keeps getting her ultimate back every time her slowly gets her ultimate back while her and while her partners attack I hear some different Meanwhile her talent Makes enemies a bit entranced and follow her harmlessly. What does it actually do? Oh, not talent. Technique. Overture of Inebriation. Creates a special dimension around the character. Enemies within this dimension will not attack Robin after entering battle. While the dimension is active, Robin additionally regenerates 5 energy at the start of each wave. Wing Flip White Noise. Her basic attack deals minor physical damage to a single enemy. She will not use that a lot, I would say. Her talent, Tonal Resonance, increases all allies' crit damage and Robin additionally regenerates energy after allies attack enemies. Her skill increases damage dealt by all allies. And her ultimate, Vox Harmonic Opus Cosmic, 
Enters the concerto state. Increases all allies attack and causes all teammates to immediately take action. After an attack, Robin deals additional physical damage. While Concerto lasts, Robin is immune to crowd control debuffs. Before Concerto ends, Robin won't take turn or action lasting until the end of the countdown. So Robin essentially leaves the battle while Concerto is active. Meaning you will have just a team of three characters that will deal more damage while she is not around. Dangerous thoughts. Very dangerous. The harmony will soon play in unison. Watch my wings. Tonight, souls shall embrace. Tonight, the stars echo because of me. She also comes with her own song. Save the vigor. And as you can see, every time an enemy takes damage, after they take damage, they get a second hit by musical notes. It seems when, it's hit, when characters hit multiple enemies at once, then only one of them gets the physical damage additionally taken to them. Do you feel the beat? I certainly do feel the beat. Don't worry, I'll always be with you. And that's already all there is to say. See you for the next gacha.